Okay, so I got all the stuff clean for this uh, live center, this ideal live center, um, ideal industries. Um, I cleaned the bearings, <clears throat> excuse me, I cleaned the bearings in an ultrasonic uh, bath, um, a heated ultrasonic bath. <clears throat> I used WD 40 in a metal container and then put that in the heated bath uh, and then ran these for a while. Uh, now they're uh, they seem to be uh, real clean. I don't detect any uh, any um, <laughs> frozen weasel snot left in those. So got some uh, fresh grease here, uh, wheel bearing grease. So this is a very similar bearing to the wheels on your uh, on your car. So I think we're kind of ready to put this Mamaluka back together. So um, I'm going to pack these bearings off camera because I'll have to turn the camera on and off, and I'll have greased up hands so uh anyway you know it's just packing wheel bearings right you know everybody knows how to do that i think so let's get going okay so uh we're ready to kind of preload these bearings here this has got a uh um a preloading nut here and then you just you back it up with a it's got a hex broached in the inside here so Kind of back it up like that. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to preload it pretty heavy and then I'm going to back it off. <laughs> Try to back it up. <laughs> okay. Everything's turning there. And then it has a set screw. Um, that has a little cushion that pushes against the threads of that. Um, so, and this thing wasn't super tight when I took it apart. Something like that. Let's see here. Yeah, a little more, maybe. I think uh, I think we're ready to go into the uh, put it back in the housing now. Yep. Okay. Okay. So uh, I was going. Yeah. Geez. How am I going to press this back together? Um, and I said, Oh, well, why don't we just stick it in the lathe, right? I can actually use this to kind of hold this thing just lightly that and that holds it on center and then clever guy <clears throat> would just put the other bit in the tailstock like so and then push them together right well that's uh, that's the theory anyway let's see how she behaves there it goes to put a little spacer behind there. Okay. All right. I got to go in a little bit farther because there's the uh, the seal bit. I need a piece of uh, a piece of something um, tubing or something like that. Let me go grab something. Right, good, old, good old socket, right? Yeah, that hardened right up. All right, that's it. Let's see how it looks. Oh yeah, looks about right. Okay, let me uh, get the seal, the little seal plate, and then uh, go from there. All right, so there's the brass seal plate there. And uh, we'll do this last little bit here. I think we're just gonna use our, our socket tool here. To, oops, to push that in. There it goes. Alright, that's it. I'm going to jam it in there real hard. And 
This one's kind of stiff. Okay, and I'm gonna pack some more grease in there and uh, put the plug back in the rear end and uh, give it a spin. Okay, so I didn't have a, a, a grease gun loaded with this stuff around, so I'm putting it in a different way here. I got a disposable syringe that you cut the tip off, whatever size you want, so I'm just packing it with some of this, this particular grease that I'm using here. And then we're going to uh, inject. All right. to tell huh oh hey okay I didn't think there was a hole through that thing huh interesting hmm. it's okay well, I think I got enough in there <laughs> excuse me huh that's uh, kind of peculiar that uh, that screw has a, uh, a hole through it. I didn't notice that earlier. Okay, so I'm gonna call that packed with grease and uh, this uh, is officially fit for running. It's stiff, it needs to be run. I was able, you know, I clamped it in the vise and I was able to turn it, so uh, I'm not too worried about it. Um, so, put that in the rack and next time I need a center, I'm gonna try it. Alright, so this is my old live center. This is the one that came with the machine. And uh, it's got it's got some pretty scroungy looking sounding bearings. So this is gonna be one of the next projects here is uh taking this thing apart. But I'm just gonna do a little a little preparatory here. Put a little penetrating oil on that face ring right there. And then I think, yeah, this one's loose here. Oh, yeah, see, that's got a pilot bearing in the rear end there. Okay, well, we'll just give that a little, give that a little. All right, so we're gonna let that, let that sit for a few days, and then we'll. Uh, We'll bust that one open and see what we got.